it's set up in Cloudy Event, and I'm going to do another flow. And I'm going to dedicate this one to James Mackey, City Skater. He comes from Houston area. He's a blader out there, and he does a lot of flows. He's got a channel on YouTube, so I'll put the link so you can check him out. A lot of uh, creative stuff. So yeah, check him out. Let's see how this one goes. So yeah, usually when I start, I start in the driveway and I like to look to the back and to my area and give a scan of where I'm going to go and who might be there. I do this because I'm a lone skater and I'm a girl. So it's kind of good practice to do. You have to scan where you're going to be and who's going to be there. And in my neighborhood, you never know who's creeping around. They're usually kids. I call them kids. They're kind of like, I guess they might be like teenagers or like in their 20s or something. I don't really know. But there was some skateboarders out there, and uh, I kind of fucked up what I was going to do because I was going to go a different way, and I had to go another way just so I could avoid anything. Yeah, I noticed that I'm getting a lot more comfortable with the skates and this looks like more energetic as far as it will go skate flow of mine so far. I got more used to these skates. I think um, I just found out the other night that the ankle part of the boot can be tilted forward and that's pretty cool because I didn't know that could happen. They were more straight up, right? And it was kind of unnatural. So being able to have them more at a tilt forward reminds me of my oxygen skates and uh, it makes it easier to bend your knees and stay low. So I felt more natural. I'm getting more used to these skates. What I want to do is I want to get, I want to get some bigger wheels. I want to get those one tens, those tries. But yeah, these are good for now. been raining a lot and it was kind of annoying to have all the rain that's stopping me from skating so the weather got better. And oh the ice cream truck. That's right. Ice cream in the hood. So yeah, this is the same area that I skated the last flow that I did, or the first one I did. And this was just a different, I wanted to show more area that I can skate on. Now all that part right there had a bunch of twigs and, le and yeah, sticks and whatnot. And it's always that's always something to look out for uh, to all you people out there that you know are new to skating, just getting into it or whatever. You always have to scan the area right in front of you because you never know what might be there. It could be, you know, sticks or, or rocks or whatever. And I've had my fair share of, of taking a hit for not paying attention. So you have to constantly be paying attention. Adjusting the knee pads. 
That's right. Yeah, I did a little Instagram clip of this right here. Dropping off a curb. I thought that looked pretty cool. One thing I will say that I know I need to work on is crossovers. I don't do them because I'm not comfortable with them because I never really uh, did them before. I'd rather do like a double skip sometimes. And today was pretty decent weather. I mean, it wasn't too hot and the day is longer now because we had to do our daytime, what is it, savings? Daytime savings thing where you spring forward, spring ahead. So yeah, that means that we're gonna have longer days which is cool. But it wasn't so windy. It's usually super windy. And it, I've been here, I've lived here all my life and I've never had noticed how windy it's been until just like a couple of years now. So here I'm going to get heckled in a minute. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what he said. <laughs> I was too busy being badass. I couldn't, I couldn't make out what he said. I'd like to think he said, you look pretty badass, but yeah. <laughs> it's whatever. I hope you enjoyed this little short flow that I did is just a different way around the same uh, location that I like to frequent. I need to change locations. Maybe the next one will be somewhere else. So it won't be so boring. But thank you for watching.